Hi, this is Sweet June. How's everybody doing today? Getting ready to go to bed. I just wanted to do a quick diet journey update. Um, went to the doctor. I'm a little disappointed right now because I've only lost two pounds in the last two months. So my weight loss is not going, it's not as fast as it was um um i was i think before i was at least losing four to five pounds a month in, in the last two months i've only lost two pounds but i'm still losing but just very very slow and so i'm a little i'm not losing it as is um I, I i expect it to be at a certain point and have a certain amount of weight off at this time because my goal was to i, w I wanted to be at my goal weight by July because I started in July but I don't think I'm gonna be at my goal weight in July um, so um, the doctor said that's okay she said you know it's okay to lose it slow um, um, long as she said as long as I'm not gaining as long as I'm steady losing and I'm not gaining she said that's fine um, my metabolism is a little slow um, um, I, I do have a thyroid problem, you know, uh, I have an underactive thyroid, and I think that might have something to do with it. I do take the pill, but, you know, um, and plus, by it be, I think by it being wintertime, you know, wintertime is a time when pe people typically gain weight. Wintertime is a little bit harder to lose weight because you're not as active, you know, which I was still trying to get to the gym, and some, some weeks I wasn't getting in there um only two days or whatever because of the weather and and then um my energy level is really low i'm getting ready to do a sleep study and and see they think they might that i might have sleep apnea so i'm getting ready to do a sleep study because my energy is low i'm tired a lot midday around midday i get really really tired and drained i just want to lay down so um it's it's a little frustrating right now, but I'm still trying to stay on track, and um, you know, um, I, I I I'm pretty used to eating, um, the way I've been eating. Um, I I'm officially off of cow's milk. I officially don't drink cow's milk anymore. Um, I'm I'm drinking unsweetened almond milk now. Um, so I was able to go back to my cold cereal. Um, the, I wasn't doing the cold cereal before because of the cow's milk between the cereal and the milk was making it too sweet. But I officially don't drink cow's milk anymore. I love the almond milk. It's delicious and it doesn't have any sugar in it because I drink the unsweetened. So I'm just, that's where I'm at. Just wanted to give you guys a quick update on my diet journey. But I'm still, the doctor said it's okay. I'm still losing, but it just very slowly. The weather's getting ready to get nice, so I'll be able to go out and do my walking and everything like that. So hopefully it'll start picking up within the next couple of months here. But I'm still on task. Um, I'm still, you know, um, I'm feeling better than I was. Still get some leg pain. Still get some back pain. But you have to take in consideration that I am getting older. And so my age is a factor in there, too. It wasn't just the weight. So... But it's a lot, but ten times better than what it was. So, um, just wanted to give you guys a quick update on my diet journey. I got some more interesting video topics coming up. This is Sweet Jill.